in general, a lot of the education policy debate in the U.S. is currently framed in a what can be done through schools approach. If you start talking about these other things like poverty or public health differences or inequality or social services, uh, some reformers see that as a distraction or as an excuse for schools. By suggesting that non-school factors are important, you're suggesting that the schools, you know, have a ready excuse. I'd like to see that polarized debate um, put behind us and recognition of the obvious fact that both schools matter and non-school factors matter.